I just want to give an encouragement to the athletes that are going to Paris. That no matter what version we are, we are the strongest. We are the strongest. We are the strongest role models of the world. So don't let that little demon boy from America we name Noah. We, we take a little girl from Jamaica again and use her. I just want to give an encouragement to the athletes that are going to Paris. That no matter what version we are, we are the strongest. We are the strongest, we are the strongest role models of the world. So don't let that little demon boy from America we name Noah. We, we take a little girl from Jamaica again and use her to learn about us. That them can, Because the only way that they can go against us is to use us against us. That's the only way. So I want to say to my Jamaicans, them who are truly patriotic, who is going over to Paris to this Olympics? Make sure say you know say this is the Olympic of all Olympics because they want to put Jamaica on our feet. They want to put us on our knees. They want us to bow down so that they can say they took us down and they took us from God. But make we show them say we lick but we tell our for you. I would have love if a youth like all Usain Bolt too can come out and give a word of encouragement to a real athletes them. Not the gay one them where them are come plant in our, in our team them. We push them agendas through with sports. We push them agendas through with music. We push them agendas through with politicians them. PNP, Lisa, Anna, you can bat for the system underneath Jamaican banner. Babsy Grange, you sold us out to the beast. You swallow out with culture and turn with culture in a brand. And that to not do to Jamaica. And make the world a laugh off of Jamaica and a treat we like we mediocre. But me a beg those of us who know. And know so we don't have to use no violence. And we don't have to use no chop up. And we don't have to use no burn down. But we can stand up and make the world know say, that Jamaica there is still alive. That Jamaica there is still well, and we no want no demon to be with influencer. We no want no doppy to be with influencer. We want real living people who know our culture, know where we stand for, know where we believe in, know who we are. If we stand up and make the world know, say Jamaica not dead. We not dead. Me not dead. We not dead. We alive. And we the world are weird pan to set the world free. This woman here, where does where they make become the, 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 the vice president, we know why them did make somebody with Jamaican blood inside of them. Look what them are doing with culture, them are turn with culture in a brand while the true living people where the culture belong to. Sit down and a suffer. Tony Rebel come to the front of the class. I have something to say to you. Me notice say you sit down and make Joe Bogdanovich take Rebel salute and turn it in a some face. A years me sit down in the background and say to you, say, Mr. Rebel, listen when me I say to you, if you not protect Rebel Salute because you are saying no alcohol, no meat, no profanity, they are not going to support you. It's the people have to go stand up with you. So whatever it takes, you have to go make the people them know say is because you not choose to go with them while them fight you. And Mr. Rebel, you know, listen to me. And now you make scatter borrel them turn red, green, and gold in a Saddam and Gomorrah underneath rum and sadamism. And that you make a up, Mr. Rebel. And you need to stand up and come from behind the curtains and come be the soldier for Jamaican people. Unite yourself with Buju Bantan and Berry Saman and the whole of the artists, them who stand up on the front, who can show off with them big crowd, them where they can gather. Who not gather them crowd there for? Who? Who not gather them crowd there for? Is it for the benefit of the people and the country that made Uno into the giants where Uno be that Uno afraid for get up so much that Uno afraid for come back come stand up with the said people them 
Jamaica deserve more than this. The real Jamaica deserve more than this. We should not sit on the sideline and allow our beloved Mecca of the world to look like this in front of the world. So make we do the right thing and Jamaica people the ultimate right thing for all of these leaders that I'm talking about to do in music, in politics, is to first of all speak the truth about what the kinder tree really mean, which is the cotton tree down a pakiti, down a trilani, down a flagstaff, where we real ancestors stood with God and told the oppressors after years, many, many years of them trying to conquer us, they had to come to the bushes to say, I surrender to you and I respect you and I pledge to live alongside you peacefully. It wasn't us who went to them. It was them who came to us. So how oh, we are turned this now? One kinder, one Jamaica, one Africa, one world. That is the new republic. That is the change. That is the approach where we need to make to make the world be the better place to advance the whole human race. That is the role where Jamaica is supposed to play. Not this one where them hurrying up to turn us into slaves down here. By the food where them are getting the KFC I feed we because them like we. You think that Jerry and Nevio have rump and the ground spread out like wildfire because them love we? No. It's control. It's control. This is not who we are as a people. This is not who we are as a people. This is not who we are as a people. And the maroon community can fix it with first of all the unity, the ultimate unity in the maroon communities. I am telling the, the maroon that, that, are, that are going with the system to stop, to no, say no to the George Soros of the world and the big guns of the world and the big forces of the world who no matter who they are, they have to establish out of Jamaica. L.A. Lewis, you need to bring back the stuff that Rastology gave you. It does not belong to you, son. Bring it to the rightful place so that Jamaica can function from the rightful place. The people... It belong to the people. Jamaica, the land belong to the people of Jamaica. We are a sovereign country. Big up Kenya. Thank you for standing up. And from what I'm hearing, truthfully standing up. Not no dark forces infiltration. We have to do something right now. We have to do something right now. We have to do something right now. And the thing to do right now is the right thing. Stand with the creator. Stand with our ancestors. Stand, stand with where the real truth lies. Let your mouth become a sharp sword against the dark forces. Tell these, these dark artists that you don't want them to influence your children anymore. These dark promoters, these dark producers, that you don't want them to produce music for your ears and for your children anymore. Buju Banton, I'm saying this again to you publicly. You are on the wrong side, son.
Jesse Royal, Father, I'm saying this to you publicly. And you know why I'm saying this to you publicly. Do the right thing. Do the right thing and spread the right news in the Maroon communities. Because it's unity we're aiming for in the Maroon communities, not more division. One united Maroon community, one united Jamaica, one united Africa, one united world. That's what you all say I should die for. Because I'm saying that Anu, that's what I should die for. That's what I should die for. Anu, that's what I should die for. Or we should be all saying unity, real love, real maroon family unity. I am not going to sit and have you guys spread false rumors around my name in the maroon communities. It's very damning and dangerous.